All right, hello everyone. Rising Fun Gaming here. Welcome to another stream. Let's get cracking as per always. We are 28th of spring. We've got a festival today, don't we? Okay. Exciting times ahead in approximately two hours, just over two hours. We're going to get the latest and probably last trailer for Monster Hunter World Iceborne, so mm, I thought I'd stay up until that comes out. So bonus stream, did someone say b -b -b bonus stream? I think so. How much can we get done in two plus hours? We shall see. If we're super good, we'll crack into summer. Lovely. First things first, greet the animals. Hey, that's a good gravy. And that's a good crumb. How are we looking? Alright, we got a fair bit of housekeeping to do. Can't believe I didn't accidentally use my choo choo. Oops, I don't want that. Going there. What does that bring us to? 20. Did someone say nice? If they didn't, they should have, because that's very. Oh, Kadoka. Go, go. <laughs> Gotta make a bit of money from those. Starting to get another stack of these, so let's shove it over. Well, Dude, this page is going to get full soon. Sort those. Looking fantastic. Well, luckily we've got this page to back us up. We'll probably have to put these seeds over there eventually, huh? Okay. Unfortunately, we can't purchase that fertilizer today, can we? Oh, look at that! Three in a row! The perfection. We're going to get another cloud today. Pretty hyped for that. Are we fertilizing these anymore? I think we are. Boop. Fertilizing these. I don't actually know if these flowers are going to bloom in time. They should, shouldn't they? They should be blooming in time before the end of the season. Be a very sad little camper if they didn't. Give me that. Did someone say choo choo train? <laughs> also, do we have our harvest by friend? We don't, do we? Not commissioned. Oh, I've got some, I guess I've got some news. I looked up a Japanese, I guess you could call it a tutorial. The guy had um, played it for a while and he was talking about the U-Core system, the uh, friendship level system for these guys. Um, but TLDR, there's no real benefit to just getting their hearts up because they're always going to be degrading. So the plan with those simply should be just just keep hiring them and don't worry about getting their hearts up. Because whilst getting their hearts up makes them continue to work for more days in a row. Oops, no, 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 no. You're continuously having to babysit their, their love for you. And I think, I think this guy, like he experimented a little bit or a fair bit. And he was even giving them, you know, their best present, the little cog thingos. But yeah, the TLDR of it was, as far as he's concerned, it's a really dumb system and you needn't bother trying to get their hearts off. <laughs> but what I didn't understand from what he was saying was it's, pr it's probably still beneficial to 
keep giving them stuff because they might get to a point where they abs oops, absolutely refuse to do anything for you. Um, but like getting them into coloured hearts, level 2 and above, there might not be much practical sense to it. And because that's the case, yeah, it's, it's a very weird choice on the game designer's part. Uh, perhaps this will be of relevant information and knowledge to those that wish to play this when it comes out to the west. Um, or not. Because they might actually tweak it a bit with an update. Who knows. But, I don't know. I think we're getting to about the end of all I have to say about that silliness. So if a Japanese person that can understand Japanese better than I comes to the conclusion that I was sort of coming to anyway, that, you know, it's dumb. <laughs> and it's probably a waste of our time trying to work with that system. Um, yeah, we might just keep hiring them every buddy two, three days, whatever it is. Oops. Also, something that I found out by watching this person was I think uh, yeah the bell works on multiple animals which is good and I was gonna say yeah all you really need to do is ring it near the entrances I was wondering if there was a little bit more of a bit more to it than that but yeah just ring them near the entrances and you're good they'll come out of their own accord we kind of figured that out I think Today being the festival day, we won't have people where we expect them to be. So what are we going to do? It shouldn't be any different to any other festival in terms of... Yep, finishing at 6pm. Watering can. days after they get to this stage they get flower. I had a little bit of a look at the layout of this farm and if we want three 5x5 five five plots running vertically like this and we want paths in between each plot and a fence running around the entire perimeter we're not going to be able to do it we're going to be one line low or short so it's gonna be weird I'm highly considering abandoning fences and just having paved areas on the outermost boundary highly highly considering that so that we can have paths in between both uh, five by five plots yeah, I'm highly considering just doing away with fences. It's either that or we have one conjoined 5x5 five five and one with a path running through it, which is... Mm, it's not that pleasing to look at, is it? So we'd better make our mind up by summer. And also, I've been highly considering just getting rid of a lot of insects from my collection because that other chest is just breaking my spherical things between my leg. Z, if you know what I'm saying. I guess we'll go get this cloud. Um, oh yeah, but first. Better get our dock or demo door. Should be in this um, part of the map, right? Perhaps not. Uh, 
Ah, below us. Hey, Jion, I want to give you something here. Where's our squirrel friend? Oh, did I put an axe in my back? Okay. There he is. The butterfly sanctuary. So the first... I'm thinking of eliminating sets of insects from my collection. And the first set I think we're going to get rid of is going to be grasshoppers and their ilk. The only insect that I know I absolutely must keep is the Kabuto Mushi. Because we needed it for the race last um, season, didn't we? Oh, what's he want? Quest time. Is that really going to be worth my time? I think so. A Margaret for five daikon radish. Yeah, that's going to be worth it. Because we can gift them back to him eventually. He loves them. I'm surprised that he's actually willing to use them as a reward. Parting with them. His favourite. Speaking of grasshoppers, are getting rid of them. Now, I was very curious upon looking at the achievement list about this stone fragment thing we're supposed to be able to pick up. We might go over to this uh, wall over here and give it another inspection. Insects sure are out today. Something is written. I don't know how I'd translate that. Something about... It's... Something that the father doesn't know. Or it's a shop? That the father. Wow, what does that mean? Let me just quickly look it up to see if we can find any sort of meaning. That's an interesting um, bit of writing. Otosan Wakarazuya. Literally, father doesn't understand, and I don't know what the ya means in this context. Obstinate person, blockhead. Oh, interesting. So, father, blockhead. Blockhead father. <laughs> I have no idea what to read out of that. Interesting. Well, if you've got any ideas, make sure to let me know. Cryptic. Is it referring to the um, general goods store father? We might have enough room for a little bit of a beach comb. Oh yeah, we want to get the cloud. of some of these insects 
in the form of gift. Also, you're working for me tomorrow, please. I got three half star butterflies. Yeah, okay. It's gonna be kind of tempting to buy something different for a change. What was this one again? This is the thing for three in-game, for the space of three in-game hours, gives us ridiculously good luck for things like fishing. Could this be the, could this be the cure to our Marlin woes? It's almost worth doing a scum save to find out. What do you reckon? Did someone say scummy boy? Raises hand sheepishly. Give me two of them. Mm, lucky moon. Oh, we're gonna get a tutorial. Hey, how do you use this? I'm not really sure on the particulars, but hey, I'll just give it a go. What? But if you don't use it properly, it could be dangerous. No, no, it'll be fine. Uh, fine, I'll go call to Roman. Hey, number to cord. Hey, to Roman. Oh, it looks like you've gotten your mitts on the um, lucky moon. Yeah. Well, upon using it for the space of three hours, your luck will vastly improve. You can use it for things like when you're fishing or for when you're mining. Surely something excellent will come of it. Oh, thank you for telling me. Well, keep on doing your best, Nobitaku. <laughs> that really wasn't necessary. It was all in the item description. Take it again. If this thing gives me a marlin, I'm definitely going to purchase it. Alright. Backpack. Rid of that. Um, Alright. We want that. That. And uh, I don't know how extensively we'll be testing this. Let's go to the most obvious location of where a marlin should be. So I guess the order of operation should be use the lucky moon, spread the chum, chuck the line out. Let's see. Okay. He eats it. Is it like a moon pie? That time's ticking back down fast. Give me the rod. Thank you. All right. Come on, baby. Fingers crossed. Is this the way to Marlin? If so, this is totally going to be worth it. <sighs> don't get your hopes up, uh, RFG. Just don't. Just don't do it, man. I still don't even know if the shadow is bigger than that one. I feel like it should be, but ugh, I gotta pull these right. 
Okay. I'm not feeling the luck so far. So once we catch the next one, and if it's not the marlin, I wonder if we should continue fishing in this area. Or quickly hop to somewhere else. I've always felt like it's sort of capped at three fish for any one spot for a good chunk of the day. So I always move on after three, but we have been getting four in the mines and whatnot. Right, so apparently that was super good luck at work. Well, it was consistently the same fish. Perhaps it sells for much more than the other standard fare we would otherwise get. stick to this spot for the rest of the duration get disappointed and then we'll go to the left side of the seaside we'll try casting out there so if we're using silver rod high grade chum plus lucky moon and we don't get a marlin I think we could safely conclude that we're not going to get it with this rod in this season. I mean, no, just in this season. I think that's all I can conclude. I believe this was sort of the other famous, popular, nice area. I can't stack them. Okay, I'll just wait for it to run out. I'm hoping that uh, it's not a time issue either. Time of the day issue. For all I know, there's a small window of time there available each day for anyone. Oh, for the season it comes, or seasons. In any case, if we're not successful here, I think it's a bit of a reset. Mm. So, something's telling me just to wait until there's a bigger shadow than that. That's what I'm going to do. For the rest of the duration of this one, it's not bigger than the previous shadow, I'm just going to ignore it. I think that's a fair experiment, don't you? I think so. Otherwise, it's just starting to get too much effort for a video game. <laughs> there, go away. I'm desperately trying to remember when I caught those other big fish in other areas of the map. Whether they were the, um, whether their shadows were bigger than that. Mm. I so want to pull this though. Man, they're coming very frequently. Mm, I bet it's just not the season. Okay, well, we should potentially have two more fish here. 30 minutes left. Let's quickly get the next one. 
Be a tie. Yep. Last chance, Charlie. A fair experiment. Oh, oh, what was the quality? Okay. Mm. Maybe connected to the item, maybe not. Alright, I'm satisfied with that. I reckon. Now let's put these gear things to their intended purpose. Hi. Which is you. Beautiful. Flowers don't have. Yeah, thank God those don't have quality values. How much room we got? Oh, yeah. I wish there was some sort of buyback scheme for the fences. I could like get a refund of the wood that I contribute. <laughs> Oops, <laughs> speaking of wood, why the hell am I attempting to sell it? <sighs> Ditto to beef. Um, I guess... Actually no, we've got lots of presents to give. They're gonna be presents. Cloud goes. Oh, I want to start putting them down here. Put you there for now. I think it's time to collect these. I hope that I can put these in the shed. Actually, this is gonna have to go too. Dems to breaks. Hmm, we've got a lot of work to do on the actual property here. Coming up. Oh, it doesn't go in here. Furthering my woes. Uh, maybe we can just sell them. Same with that. Okay. Oh, this arch is so cool, though. 
just feels like it belongs so much to a Harvest Moon property. Oh, it makes me sad. We might find a use for it sometime. Okay, well, goodbye. <laughs> goodbye. Oh, I don't know. Goodbye. <laughs> you too. I just feel like I need to... <gasps> mm, let's not be hasty. Maybe we can do like a special little... I don't want the gates. The gates are pen house. Might have a special little area in the bottom plot of land. I'm not selling these guys either. Are we happy? I think so. Now, we're going to have to thin out this collection. Time to say goodbye to Grasshopper Kind. Crickets included. And that's what we're doing, aren't we? Is there another variety we should just cull now as well? Mm, cicada kind? Butterfly kind? Man, that would free up a lot of spaces. Yeah, while we're at it. Oh, we're full. Oh, this breaks my heart. Stupid game. It's your fault, game. Not mine. Um. Butterfly kind as well. Oh, you're not a butterfly. I don't even know what I group you as. Sad face. This can go... Ugh, here, I guess. There you go. My soul is destroyed. And there, the dirty deed is done. What are we doing next? Ooh. Stamina drink check. I think we're... Yeah, we're out. Hmm. Which begs the question, what the heck are we going to do with our time here? Oh, I know. Bit of this. This doesn't need stamina. Yes, gravy. Ruiner of productivity, little hund. So worth it. Good thing we've got 30k, huh? Because we can easily spend that on this paved road nonsense path. Wish you could just hold down the button and it could auto lay down while you want. Should be a path running here, right? One, two, three, four, five. Yep, it will be. Oops. Oh, I think that was right, actually. Something along those lines. Yeah. Clear that. It's about time we hit this party. Oh, we got these. Oops. 
before we forget before we forget would be remiss of us to forget hey cavalry bees do they still get flower honey if you plant flowers nearby <gasps> I've never tried I don't know now I'm super curious experiment with that. I wonder if you can put bees in the hothouse. I gave her a five star. <laughs> She's worth it. What star? Mm. I was just about to ask what star she is. something to everyone. Except for Yama, anyway. Okay. Did I do it properly? I think so. Well, we know exactly what they're saying. Welcome to this year's Crops Festival. Here's the judges, here's the contestants. The thing is, I didn't press the handover button. I just talked to him with the five star in the item wheel. I don't know if that means that he's judging my five star or the other ones that I was holding. I think, I think he's judging the five star. Maybe it's the third place. Yep. Second place. Good. We win. And the first place winner. Oh, not yet. And the first place winner is. First place is. Come on. No, 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 Beta. The child prodigy. Turnip Prodigy. Enjoy the fanfare, kids. It's both it's both lengthy and girthy. My god. I can't believe that someone made such a fantastic crop. Oh. It's so great. I really want to dig into it. Alright, so now we better award the trophy to the winner. So this is our first springtime crop festival contest trophy. Everyone give our winner a huge round of applause. Okay, that's the end of the contest. I look forward to seeing everyone compete in next year's. And for those that didn't quite get the results that we were expecting, never fear and do your best and come back to compete next year. Well done, Nobita. Congratulations for your victory. But actually, I only handed you the fake trophy, the replica. So if you want the real deal, make sure to come and sue me. Thank you. I suspect they've done this because... Actually, no. 
I don't know what they think. Back to Cozy Farms. What's um what's her love for me? It's still blue. <laughs> I gave her a five star turn up lol. Um Did I say hi Rainbow if I didn't? Hello. Raking in those wins. Hell yeah. So now we've got the crop contest trophy for every season now. Back in the fridge. Should we have a little kip here? Have a little kip. No, let's put the animals in first. Where's the other chook? Hiding behind the machine, isn't it? Yep. Should probably go and um get a little bit of crops or forage rather as well. Oh, I wonder what he's doing up here. Don't do it, man. You've got a long life yet ahead of you. Do not contemplate it. That reminds me of um, Breath of the Wild. The, what is it? Is it Hyrule Bridge? Or well, the bridge not too far from Hyrule? There's that guard there that keeps trying to convince you not to commit suicide. Oops. Did that bug go away? Damn it. The cool thing about this uh, chimney stack is that you can creep faster as well. So <laughs> when you need to creep up on the bugs, <laughs> it's pretty um, easy to deal with. It's nice. Get a biscotti. Doing well. How you doing, my friend? I think I just scared away a bee there. I was gonna have a kip and I was gonna go mining. But I kinda want this wood. I guess we can do both. Good. I miss all your streams because of time zones. Uh, yeah, when I was really a streamer, <laughs> I was streaming like mornings Australian time. But now that I'm a a working person, <laughs> um, I stream at night time. Not to say that streaming isn't work, it is pretty fucking tough. It can be. Depending on what you want out of it. How much stamina did that get us? Okay. Makes sense. Do I live in Japan? Yep. Still live in Japan, yep. Yes, yes. So it's my second time living in Japan, and it's my second year on this stint. And... yeah. Our little Nobby Chan's almost dead. Let's push him to the brink. And that'll do. Tomorrow's Tuesday, the clinic had better be open.
I like my seaside bed and my seaside wallpaper and my seaside carpet. That totally doesn't clash with the wood grain of the kitchen. Not at all. Clinic. Yeah, it's open. Happy. How much space did we end up generating in this? Two. Ooh, quite a bit there. Dangly dangly. Makes me happy. Oh, look at those bountiful strawberries. My god. Did someone say profit? Um. Alright, I've got to get my head around what we're doing here. No, don't do that. The same thing we do every day. Fertilize. Try to fertilize the world. Or is that take over? Try to take over the world! Um. What am I doing? What am I doing? Fertilize. Animal husbandry. Don't think we got any wool coming in today, but just in case. Lead. Fertilizing the world would be quite the achievement. gravy. Where's my little pup? Barf! Where's my little barf? Where are you? Oh, that's a button. You know what we do with butterflies now. <laughs> Sell them. Where's my pooch? Pooch! He's disguised in. He's camouflaged in something. Oh, there you are. Good little mutt. Yes, yes, you deserve a pet too. Um, in terms of fertilizing, we just need to do this one. Right, that's it. Cool. to about six right <laughs> that's about six I feel so sad that we can't interact with our pregnant cow I just want to give it like a pet of encouragement you know do you deserve a present the answer is yes Get back to work. Mm -hmm. I cruise around town and the surrounds a bit, eh? 
I got lots of gifts to give. Lots of gifts to give. Oh, we'll do a beach comb as well. God, look at bear. So we've got one hour and 20 minutes until the Monster Hunter Icebon World trailer. Will we see Zin? I think we will. I think it's exceedingly obvious that we will. So people are going to be pretty chuffed. But will we see the Ketcha Watcher? That is the most pertinent question. I don't think I've been in here this early. Is the... I wonder where the doctor is. Oh yeah, we have to remember to... Margaret. There you go. Don't use it for nefarious deeds there, Doctor. Or Kurape Kurapeko. You know what? If... If Ketcher Watch is not in the game... Um... Because Kurapeko is... Oh, I'm not phrasing this the way I want. If... Hmm. Kurapeko needs to be in the game. That's what I'm, that's what I'm trying to say. If we don't get Ketchawacha and we don't get Kurapeko, then that that is that is the end. That is the end of days. The only thing that will console me significantly if there's no Ketchawacha would be if a Kurapeko comes. I'll be like, okay. That that's fair. Catch a watcher was sacrificed for Kurapeko. I, I can deal with that. That that's that's pretty good. That is the trade-off. That is the good trade-off. But if we don't get both, then I'm going to be an angry man-child and take it out on I don't know something. My pillow. Some inanimate object that doesn't have feelings. And can't fly back. Something like that. Real mature, like, you know. Um, now what the frig am I doing? Oh, yeah, let's go talk to Pasty. Did someone say Dorayaki delivery? Where is it? Don't run out. <gasps> okay. Did someone say mushroom? Take it out on Nogagante. Actually, that's a that's a good option. I feel like we should purchase some animal -y stuff. For example, mm, we've got 136 of them. 46, okay. Let's get a few more of those. That's probably good for now. I don't want to get too crazy with the money. I feel like we should make a chick. We're going to have the ability to, in a few days' time... We almost managed to take out Temp and Nogante in five minutes. It took you five minutes, five seconds. Ooh. Hot dang! chicken. Oh that's right, you must incubate an egg. There's no chicken seed. That's right. Well, I can't remember how much I've got in stock, so let's just grab 
That's plenty. Also gotta remember to get fertilized today. That is pretty crucial. Used to be coop level two. Yeah. <laughs> For some reason I had it in my mind that it was um impregnation like the other animals. And then I remembered. Yeah, ranch. Or should I say Harmon? Let's do the thing for Yame. Let's do that now before we forget. Do we have this flower? We... Oh, we actually do not. That's a sad face. Damn. I'll scrap those plants. Get the rooster. The player paid for some new chicks. <laughs> um, goodbye to you. Collection. I wish I could remember which day we commissioned the coop extension. I think we've still got a good solid three to four days left on that. Ah, oh, I meant to put you away. Almost five o'clock? No. Uh, three o'clock, I mean. No. Okay. I mean, that's what I always thought of when you paid to get a cow pregnant. <laughs> that or magic. Let's go with magic. Thank you. I wonder if I should pull any more uh, strawberries out. Okay, so we still have five of them. Oh, we still have eight of those. Um, I might just sell all that. Because how much five star seed do we have? Oh! That was a solid check there, Erfka. Glad you checked, mate. Pop. I think what we found out through that little experiment there is if you plant five star... Oops. If you plant five star... turnips and don't fertilize them, they will grow to four and a half anyway, which is... it's fair. Do you need to put the bees into the beehives? Yeah, you do. Yep. You do. So it's like previous games in that regard. Uh, what the? Oh. There we go. Now what are we doing? We'll just we'll just have one tiny more check here. Just to triple confirm we're happy with what's going to market today. I'm going to say we pull a few more strawberries out. Save a few more. There we go. Good out. Straight to the mines.
Oh, we didn't come to the beach today. I don't think. No. That means it's like Story of Seasons 2 where you don't need flowers, just the different types of bees. Something I've not experimented with is planting flowers nearby. I've got a gut feeling that that's not a thing in this game. But I might give it a go next season. Hey Legend of N, how you doing? We got another event at the very end, don't we? Oh, this garbage. Let's see what happens when we win two years in a row. Surely they won't give... Oh! Surely they won't give us another trophy. Same trophy. Hopefully in its stead they give us a huge cash prize. Or an iron ore prize, that would be nice. Who knows, I might even be banned from participation. Off to mine we go, it's off to mine we go. Hi ho the Dario, it's off to mine as we go. Mm, two more and we've got another cloud. How good is that? Time to nom. What's our money at? Again? Shire 40. Do you get rare stuff the further down? Yes. But at the moment we're just trying to get stuff in the upper levels actually. The things that we really want is iron ore. And we want these things. Like junk or odds and ends or whatever they're going to be called. Or relics. Because we trade these in at the Harvest Sprite shop for a really cool item which you would have seen on my farm, the little storm clouds with a pull string. <laughs> they they water a 5x5 five five area automatically each morning. They're something that you don't get access to this until the second year I believe. Because you can't find the harvest sprites till second year, I think. So 15 for another cloud. We've got 10 at home. So all the there's there's about seven different types of fossils which you can use them for money or you can make fossil themed furniture out of them. There's um, copper, iron, silver, gold ores. There's ruby, emerald, sapphire, diamond, gems. And those relic -y junk things. I think that's everything. Oh, and stone. They pretty much just stripped the top few layers, top few levels, rather. And that's that's the goal for today. This is the mining. We're getting a pretty damn good strike rate of these junk thingos. Better than usual. I feel. And the further you get down, the harder some of the earth gets. So in the first year of this game, you're really really desiring this current pickaxe that I have the top upgrade which can just one hit one shot every tile type 
Man, we're getting a good haul of those things. Now, do we want to do more mining? We might go have a kip. Something that's new in this game. But first, we've got a purchase to make. I don't feel like being stingy about it either. Let's do the damage to our wallet. Another one. Okay, goodbye money. Might as well go grab another one. Oh, we've got trees. And one stamina. <gasps> Remember, you've got zero stamina right now. Uh, shop. Oh, we actually have less than I thought. Oh, that's right, they're 15. Almost made a fool of myself. Okay, we'll grab this wood. How much time under the... Okay, so seven. Twenty-eight. I wish I had a better look at how much I made today. <laughs> We don't have the low quads, we might not have any the rest of the season, but we should have plums. Going to play the remake of Friends of Mineral Town for the Switch? Nah. I um have too many games on my list. I just don't know when I'll get Yeah, because of Iceborne, that's Frankly, the biggest reason. We've got Yokai Watch that I'm just feeling super bad about not playing. And also, want to get through Persona 5 and Breath of the Wild. All the video games. All the cool video games. up to four yep came out in June this came out just before it I kind of wish it was around the other way I wish I started Yokai Watch 4 before this I've kind of wanted to put this game down for ages but I am really quite enjoying it but I'm not enjoying how many hours of the day it's taking away from me I don't enjoy that bit so much but I just I want to at least get through the story I can't put it down till I do I just can't undo it this is a good thing it speaks for how much I'm enjoying it it's 
Good game. It has its bloody downsides, but all over it's really solid. Would recommend. We've got about an hour until the trailer. Getting a tiny bit, tiny bit hyped. Chickens don't sleep at eight. I really don't know the time. All I know is that I've been getting away with keeping them up about this long without any repercussions. I've not had an animal get sick yet. Knock on wood. Did they used to get pissed off after eight, did they? <laughs> Yeah, the game's pretty forgiving in that regard. And I think I'll save this other energy drink for summer. We need to start saving them. Gonna have a lot of work to do on the first. Okay, another successful day in the bag. 